Hi guys, in the previous classes we have learned what is reflection of light that is bouncing back of light on a surface and when I say what is refraction of light then you say the bending of light is called reflection of light the, pro the property of the light bending okay now how let's perform an activity and understand this concept clearly for that activity we need a transparent beaker we we fill it with some water and and a, we need a pencil now i'm going to dip this pencil some portion of this pencil inside the water as you can see here okay before this you need to understand the uh, here thickness of the pencil okay this is how it seems now when i de uh, pu put it inside the water you can clearly see do you, what do you observe here you can clearly see the thickness of the portion of pencil in water is more than the portion of the pencil outside the water the pen thickness has been increased the pencil has got thicker okay that this is one phenomena now let's do one thing we are going to put this pencil inside the water again but this time inclined inclined now what do you observe again here we observe let's see clearly we the pencil seems to be the pencil here seems to be bent the pencil seems to be bent or you can say broken so in both the cases the portion of the pencil inside the water to be thicker than the portion above water and in this case here the pencil appears to be broken near the surface of water and why does this happen if you if i ask you that because of a refraction of light the so refraction of light is bending of light in like from one medium to another medium when it passes from one medium to another medium we see the changes in the property of the light that is called refraction of light i hope you have understood the concept guys thank you so much